Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a perforated wall in Revit. So to do that we're going to need to draw a wall. I'm going to go in the architecture section and select the wall tool. I'm just going to draw a wall. Once we did that we're going to need to draw an elevation. So from the view tab we're going to select the elevation option and we're just going to, the elevation tool, I'm sorry, and we're just going to place it. Once we did that, we're going to open it by double clicking on the triangle. Once we're here, this is the boundary of your elevation. If you don't want to see that, maybe move it a bit out of the way. And this is the wall that we created in the floor plan. In order to create a perforated wall, you have to have the wall selected and you're going to click here on edit profile. And once you did that, you can see that the edges of the wall turn pink and you're going to start drawing the perforations. You can freehand them like with the simple line tool. You can do them with this rectangle option. You know, you can whatever your project needs. Okay, so once you did that and once you're happy with your pattern, you're gonna click on this green check mark and your perforations are created. As you can see, when you select the wall, the holes are empty, the patterns that you just drew. If you go on our 3D view, this is what we have. It's pretty easy and not that difficult to accomplish. Depending on how your how complex you, your pattern is, it's gonna take longer or less time. Okay, I hope this helps. Bye!